Okay, this is Pad Love with Pat's Two Cents, and I am going on with part two. Now, remember at the end of the other video where we were dealing with seduction and beguiling and manipulation and all that being all of the same? Well, another word in that was also bewitch. That was another definition. And when I looked up bewitch, I have got to read this to you via Webster. Listen up. Bewitch includes to possess. All right. <laughs> possess means to own, to hold, take control of, control, dominate. Mm, mm, mm. Prey on someone's mind. You know what all this sounds like to me? Now, what we're dealing with is the spirit or the demon of seduction. And anytime you're dealing with any of this, that's what you're tangling with. That's what you're battling with. The demon of seduction. Many of you have been hooked up with narcissistic control freaks who are possessive, jealous, jealous, manipulative, all oh, totally controlling and dominating and intimidating. And you have been cast by their spell and you're under their control. You dance to their tune, not yours. You don't even have a clue what your tune is any longer. It's their tune. Oh, it's a very dangerous place to be because many of you die by the hands of your controller, your possessor. All right, that's your warning. And then we're going to move on to more detail of the spirit of seduction. And this is just another warning. Please do not get caught up by that. Do not be charmed by the seducer. Do not be uh, mesmerized and hypnotized by the seducer. Do not do that. Because when you allow yourself to come under their spell, they can do with you whatever they please. Pull my little string and I'll dance for you. I'm your papa. Ding, ding, ding. Ding. You don't want to do that. Trust me. Anyway, let me stop. We'll go on to the next video because I want to get into detail. But I had to cover that word. Bewitch and possess. Those two words. And where they lead to. Mm, mm, mm. I hope that made sense to you. It sure made sense to me. Stay away.